Da, oh, here's a young man who really puts the weekends in. A real bedroom ball buster. Wesley Stafford. Ha oh, that makes me sound like a total workaholic. I'm not that mad, really. Where's who? Stafford. Uh, you interviewed him? Yeah. Our stakeholder synergy strategist? Ah, oh, Mr. Hughes Willis. Really it is a uh, more than genuine pleasure to... Um... Yeah, okay. Ah, uh, Wesley's going to talk us through the detail and then Sammy, you know Sammy. Do I know Sammy? <laughs> oh, God. Mr. Hughes Willis. <laughs> How are you today? All the better for seeing you, Sambo. Sambo? Oh. <laughs> we don't know why we long. Oh. <laughs> Sambo? Okay, get on with it. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, well, as you probably know already, yeah. uh, we make £3.50 net per customer per month. Yeah. Uh, over to you, Sammy. Thanks, Wes. Now, we believe that in today's fast-changing technological environment, yeah. consumers are information savvy. Oh, Sino, are you looking where it's cost, cooking? And considerably cheaper than used, are more popular with a discerning consumer than ever. Oh. And now, over to you, Wes. So, that's the basic outline, and I think you'll agree it is a win-win. Yeah. And uh, now, Sammy is going to play you uh, extracts from a typical consumer services recording yeah. to give you an idea how we can maximise the revenue stream yeah. by systematic error processing. Or in plain English, compliant error management. We feel the cousin crew discount numbers offer the greatest potential for 0878 revenues going forward. Cousin crew, bring me up to speed. Oh, it's the uh, rebrand for BT's older family and friends. It's called Cousins and Crew. Hmm. Focus Group said family and friends was too much of a parochial, and so we used a brainstorm sesh, and what come up with was Cousin Crew. He's more readily identifiable by our target demographic. Yeah, okay, let's hear the recording from the helpline then. My window's closing at 10.40. 10.40, Don? Cow's H Boss Regatta with uh, Trin and Jules. Oh, mega. Uh, okay, we analysed over 500 calls to our customer services support line. Yeah, okay, I'm sitting in the picture frame, start painting. Right, uh, Sammy? Thank you, Wes. Okay, this is Random Selector Caller. Hello and welcome and thank you for calling the TalkChat Customer Services Helpline. For training purposes and to help us ensure TalkChat provides the best possible customer service experience, all TalkChat calls may be recorded. Your call is important to us, so please listen carefully to the following nine options. Oh, fucking hell. If you're calling to sign up to TalkChat Unlimited... I'm sure you're all familiar with TalkChat services, so I'll just forward to the relevant bit, yeah? To do yeah. Something else. And if you're calling to update your TalkChat cousin crew numbers, press 9. Oh, what was I? I'm sorry, all our operatives are busy taking calls oh, at present, oh, but please continue to hold. Oh. Your call is important to us. <sighs> Talk Chat is the trading name of Talk Media Communications, PLC, part of the Unimedia Group of Companies. Call Waiting also offers opportunities to inform customers of promotional offers. Yep, and it's 100% unique voice advertising. That's right. Because they do nothing else but listening to the advert. Why don't I fast forward, show you what he means? If you would. Yes, good shout, Sammy. <laughs> Why not upgrade to Super Fast Super you up stars. Fan Two Vice Star? Where's the fucking Q in here? Two. You can download the latest NVIDIA video games while texting offline to loved ones and simultaneously uploading your face into Facebook. I'll grab fuck off, just to the minute updates for new versions. Gotta say, Simon, I don't think this chap's fully on board. Um, Wizlet? Um, once customers have chosen the option they require, yeah. we try to ensure that over 90% of callers are kept holding for less than 60 seconds before they're put through. Yeah. Even though he's trying to keep them on the line as long as possible, it's still about the laws of diminishing returns. Yeah. So he has to be careful about the not to overdo the time they've kept waiting. Yeah. Um... I'll fast forward again then. Oh, good call, Sammy. TalkChat is experiencing unusually high call volumes at present, but please bear with us while we put you through to someone who can answer your call. We apologize for the delay in answering your call, which is important to us. Please hold while we put you through to a customer services operative. You are third in the queue. Ah, uh, 10.40 sign. Yep, then I've really got a moose. Ah, uh, uh, sorry it seems to be dragging on, Don, but of course, uh, irony of ironically is that is somewhat the point we're, well, uh, yeah. uh, pointing out. Sime, numero uno, if I ever need something pointing out to me that's this bloody obvious, then switch off the life support. Numero duze, I don't do irony. Yeah, oh.
our office forward then. Thanks, Wes. To when the customer actually gets through to an operative. Oh, oh good idea, Wes. 10.40. Totally. Good afternoon, Top Chat Customer Services. Ian speaking, how can I help About you? About fucking time. I've been holding on that line for like 20 minutes. Is you that? Yeah, how can I help you? Well, I got my bill through today and it's like totally fucked up. All my cousin crew numbers is wrong and you ain't applied any discount at all to them. Yeah. And I clearly specified all the correct numbers in my welcome pack, which I sent you like a three week ago. So what's going on? Can I have your talk chat account number, please? Oh, yeah, yeah, I got it. Are you 550-8111-A1T? Can you confirm the first line of your address, please? It's flat to Embryas. I'm sorry, can you repeat that, please? I can't hear you. Oh, fuck's sake. H-A-N-B-U-R-Y. H-A-N. B-U. Yeah. R-Y. Hambre. Yeah. Thank you. Am I speaking to Mr. Chang? Oh, that's right. How are you today? Yeah, I'm fine, but I've been hanging on this line for like half a fucking hour and it's cost me a shitload of my mobile. Sorry about that. Would you prefer to call back later? No, I fucking wouldn't. Now please put the right cousin crew numbers on my bill so I'll get charged the right amount. For security purposes, I have to ask you a couple of security questions. Oh. Please, can you confirm your pet's maiden name? Toodles. We've increased the number of security questions in line with the perceived increase in par phishing attacks. Okay, get on with it. And can I have letter number six from your memorable nickname, please? Ah, uh, M. M for Mike. Nah, M for Mike. I'm sorry, can you repeat that, please? M for mother. M for brother. No, M for mother. And letter number two, please. Ah, uh, Ching. T for Tango. No, D. Fucking D for Drongo. If you continue to be abusive, I'll have to terminate this call. Oh, fuck's sake. D, D, D for Doris Day. How may I help you? As I said, you got all the cousin crew numbers wrong on my bill, so I've been overcharged. Can you hold, please? Oh, fucking stupid, useless prep. What the fuck's he doing now? Hello? Can you not fucking put me on hold? I've already been waiting for half a bleeding hour. If you continue to be abusive, I'll have to terminate this call. Oh. Listen, can you change my cousin crew numbers or what? You'll need to tell me which cousin crew numbers you're not happy with. All of them, the lot, all ten of them, none of them is right. So do you want to update the numbers then? Yes. Putting you through to that department. Whoa. Oh, Jesus Christ, why is that fucking Welcome going? to the Talk Chat Cousin Crew re-edit hotline. Please choose from the following options. If Our cousin crew updating yeah. is actually handled by a voice recognition system. Calling for any other reason, say other reason. Now. Nah. Other reason. You said activate bonus. If I'm right, say you're right. You're wrong. Nah. You're so fucking wrong. I'm sorry. I didn't catch that. Did you say you're right? Nah. Nah. Fucking nah. I'm sorry. I'm having difficulty understanding you. Oh. Perhaps you have a speech impediment. Please hold while I put you through to someone who oh, can answer your call. Fucking you said fucking machine. All our representatives are busy right now. Please try again later. Oh, well that call actually lasted just over 28 minutes. And at 45p a minute, um, which is why it's a win-win. Win-win. Hmm. Oh, uh, thanks, Tim. Rad work. Well, Uber. So, Don, what do you think, going forward? Well, Sam, I think the wind's blowing in both directions on this one. Since IMEG took over Apple Steak and Blue Chip, Ted Bracknell moved out of Campag and Adelphi merged. Get my drift? <gasps> yeah, if the committee at TCT see that our steak and Usenet puts us in the same sphere as Zylog, uh, there could be a conflict. Uh, exactly. Uh, we're pushing the envelope in uh, people's office. Uh, uh, you know, Simo, you're so full of shit, you're teeth brown. Oh. But, uh, you know what? I'm gonna let you run with it. Oh. Get Sammy doing the monthly progress report. Oh, yeah, Sammy. And I'll run everything by legal. Uh, TNC's gotta be watertight on this one. Oh, hardcore. Wesley, terms and conditions apply. Go ahead. Oh, and I'll uh, process in the necessary contingency should, uh, off tit impose the maximum fine, yeah? You mean Ofcom, right? Uh, ten grand should cover it. Sammy, you're gonna debrief me. <laughs> Think you can keep these two boys in line? <laughs> <laughs> of course, Mr. Hughes will listen. <laughs> and the progress report will be a piece of piece, isn't it? Good girl. Oh, and uh, I'll handle the fulfilment on this one. I know a safe pair who did the chit chat welcome pack. I'll get him to give you a bell, yeah? Oh, sure, Don. Uh, we all on the same page. Uh, good. <laughs>
Right, where's my ruddy Lexus?